Dataverse, Dataverse, Dataverse. SharePoint is so popular. Why does Microsoft keep talking about Dataverse? Audrey Gordon spent 20 years as a SharePoint expert, and she's here today to tell us why she's added Dataverse to her tool belt. And she's moved it right to the front of her tool belt so she can get to it easily. And then she surprised me by giving away a free learning resource. You never know with Audrey. It's all today on PowerCat Live. Welcome to PowerCat Live. My name is Phil Toppers from the PowerCat team, and today we're here with Audrey, my fellow PowerCat, also known as Dataverse SME. Hey, Audrey. Hey, Phil. I'm so excited to be here with you. I just love your energy it's and your channel. It's about time. Yes. <laughs> I've been looking forward. So we talk about a lot of Dataverse on here, but you're fascinating because you were a SharePoint expert, and now you're Dataverse SME. Yes. What has sold you on Dataverse? Why did you throw SharePoint behind? I didn't throw SharePoint. I love SharePoint. <laughs> two decades of working with SharePoint, I love it. But I time. added Dataverse to my tool belt so that I could do even more. And let me show you. Do you mind if I show you my favorite things? I, I'm going to start by the first thing. I, that, I've been known to like a demo, Audrey. Uh, yeah, I, I'm going to show you the first thing that drew my attention. And that is when you go into Dataverse, you're given an out of the box set of tables already built for you. And these are tables that are very good for customer, supplier, uh, partner relationship management because you have a place to sure. keep the company names, a place to keep your contacts, your appointments, your activities, your emails. It's all built in. I don't have to create a table first. So I love that. But even more than that, I love the table experience and the investments that have been made for easy use. For instance, notice this grid here. This is like always an edit in Excel mode, right? You remember you have to turn that on in SharePoint? It's always on. And basically, I can go into any of these columns and literally edit them as if I was in Excel. I love that about this. And if I hit edit, now this is a preview, so it shows you like the first 10, but hitting edit would show you all your records. I only have two, but this is an awesome feature. And actually from this table, I can do so much. And we'll talk about that in a minute. But another thing I love is the new formula columns. So I'm gonna go in here and I'm just going to type calc, right? And then I'm gonna choose yeah. a formula column Right. And now what this is, is this is PowerFX integrated into Dataverse and it has IntelliSense. So I don't have to go look up anything. Right. As I start typing, it it gives me the columns that are available and then I can just go ahead and tab my way through this to make my quick formula. And this includes most Excel expressions, but you can even do if then statements and even create triggers that you can trigger power automate flows based on whether that statement is true or false. I love this. The other thing that I love about columns and tables is I can do column level security. I remember in SharePoint is I would have these lists, right? And I would push data into a list that nobody could see and the main data was in the other list. And you might end up with several lists just because you're trying to hide some level of data, right? Here, I can just take a column like this lead rating. I don't want everybody to see this lead rating. So what I did was I went into the advanced options and I just checked enable column security. That's all I had to do. Now I can decide through the admin center what I want people to do with that column. So you see all the columns that I have marked as needing column level security are listed here. And I can say which teams and users can do what things in those columns, whether they can just read them, whether they can update them. That is all in the security profile. So I no longer have to duplicate lists. I really, really love that. I, I didn't realize that's how, that's how you would do uh, that type of security in SharePoint by creating separate lists, which uh, is a little bit terrifying. So yeah, I uh, definitely like uh, column level security better. Yes. So I, I definitely, I'm a little biased, but I agree with you about everything you said about Dataverse, but you've got 20 years of SharePoint experience. Be honest with us. What do you miss about SharePoint? Here's the great news, Phil. 
I don't have to miss anything. <laughs> because if I go in here to Dataverse, I can actually, in just five wizard-like clicks, create a virtual table to SharePoint. That table, you see this table on my screen? is actually a yeah. specifications t uh, table in SharePoint. Let's suppose my whole team and everybody and their mother is using this table. I don't wanna move it, but I wanna leverage it in Dataverse so I can create this really quick virtual table. And it's dynamic. What I edit here changes there, and what I change there changes here. But now I can layer logic on top of it. So it's I don't have to miss any SharePoint at all. I, SharePoint's with me in Dataverse. I like that you implied that your mother was an employee too. I don't know what that means, <laughs> but it's good that it's a family business. <laughs> so let me ask you, so, you know, SharePoint is still a very popular data source yes. from what we see in the telemetry. Are you seeing enterprises making this move? Yes. Uh, there's probably two big reasons why they'll make this move. One, like I said earlier, once I have a virtual table like this from SharePoint in Dataverse, now I can use all of the features of Dataverse tables. And you can bring all the relevant data that you have in your company into Dataverse, layer a standard set of policies and business rules on top of it, and create kind of like a data stewardship through Dataverse, because Dataverse is not just a database. It's not just for local data. It's for data anywhere you need it. Another reason why the enterprise might appreciate Dataverse is because of what's called solutions. Solutions enable you to package your apps, your, your tables, your Power BI dashboards, your PCF components, into a package that now you can move from environment to environment. We did this in the olden days in SharePoint through PowerShell scripts. And we had all these scripts that were like replicating lists in different places. And you know, nowadays you don't need to know code to do this type of application lifecycle management. You can do it just simply by keeping everything that you're doing inside of a solution. Yeah, that's a great point about being able to move schema with solutions or even merge it right between different solutions. It's, it is really powerful. So Audrey, if you and I look down at the comments on this video, someone is right now typing, yeah, but what about licensing? Ah. So before they can submit that comment, why don't you answer it? So here is the exciting thing about licensing. <laughs> all right. So we know this is a premium connector. But notice that I am working in a Dell Vance's environment. We have extended the developer plan so that you can create your own personal environment, which is equipped with Dataverse at no additional cost. Now, I have a surprise for you. We just recently had a conference where I held a Dataverse lab where we talked about all my favorite facets house. of Dataverse. It was awesome. We had a lot of people who loved it. So guess what? I'm going to give it to you today. All you have to do is go to aka.ms slash DV lab assets and we'll put that in the description and you'll have the entire lab and you can create your personal environment. It will explain to you how to do that and you can try a whole bunch of stuff at no cost. And I know that that lab was, there were rave reviews and it was standing room only. So that is an incredible asset to have available. Thanks for sharing My it. My pleasure. If other people, if there's, where, what else should people know if they want to become a convert like you? What else is available? There is so much available. I suggest you go to aka.ms slash dataverse to find a wealth of supporting documentation. There is also MS Learn content. We even have a Power Platform Fundamentals certification that you can take, which includes Dataverse content, but also the entire platform. Why not be balanced in your learning and learn everything that's going to help you solve your problems in your everyday life? Audrey, I've been using Dataverse for over a decade and I am re-energized about going to work on it. So it was good work. And I learned a thing or two about SharePoint too while we're at it. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. My pleasure. It's great to be with you. Thanks for watching everyone. Mm -hmm.